everyone! So today I thought I would do the I Heart Spring tag which was created by Miss Glamour Otzi, aka Ingrid. She tagged everyone so I thought it would be a really cool tag to do and I thought maybe you guys could get to know me a little better. So um, why don't we just get started? Pulling up the questions on my laptop. Also, please excuse my nails. I have not had any time to do it this week. I've just been either like doing videos or tons and tons of homework. So the first question is, what is your favorite spring nail polish? So my favorite spring nail polish is this color by Essie. Here goes the nails. And it is called Playdate. So it's Essie Playdate. It's just the prettiest, like, lavender, purpley color. It's so springy. It's, like, probably the most springy color I have, and it just, like, makes me all happy inside. Question number two is, what are your must-have lip colors for spring? So, um, I'm not really a huge, like, lip color wearer. I like colors, but I don't wear them, like, on a normal basis. But, um, I'm going to say for spring, because a lot of people like to do bold lips, and very like springy, pinky, like corally colors. And I'm gonna say that like the most subtle but like springish lipsticks I have are my Revlon lip butters, which these ones are like my pink ones, and I believe I do have another pink one, but I don't know where it is. As you've probably heard about them if you are in the beauty community or watch any of beauty videos, you know how creamy they are, and like they're just basically they're all kind of pink colors like this. This one's the Strawberry Shortcake, and it's a little more, like, out there. But they come on very sheer, and I'm even wearing, I think I might even be wearing this one on my lips right now. Question number three is, show us your favorite spring dress. So I have two favorite spring dresses, and I haven't really been shopping for, like, that many spring dresses. But these are ones from last year that I just thought I'd show you. First one is... This, it's like purpley, it's got that lavender going on, if you saw my favorite nail polish color. I like those lavender colors. It has all these kind of like flowers and kind of branches, and you can see birds and butterflies on it. And um, it has a little pocket over here, but, and it has the waistband, kind of cinches at the waist here, and it stops there. And But my favorite part about this dress is it looks very conservative in the front. But in the back, there's a cutout right here. So you can see, like, the lower part of your back, not, like, your butt, because your butt, like, starts there. But it's just, like, that part of your back. And I just think it's such a beautiful dress, and it's, like, such a good material. I believe I got it from a store called Kayla. I think my second favorite spring dress is this. Well, it's actually more of a summer dress. It could be both. But um, it was from Forever 21, and it's... A high low dress and it's very confusing because it crosses in like the back but it is that's the back you can't you literally can't see but it's just stra strap strap and then crosses in the back and um, it's just this like tie-dye print and it's like washed out at places and it's high low and I just think it's so pretty and I love wearing it with a bandeau because it is a little low on the sides but um, I think it's just such a pretty like flowy dress to wear and I love it question four is what's your favorite flower um, I don't think I have a favorite flower I don't really I just think all flowers are pretty to be honest question five is what is your favorite spring accessory or scarf but I went with accessory if you know what Stella and Dot is I ordered a recent pair of like bracelets to wear that will look like nice and stackable if you know arm candy but I ordered those and they have not come in yet but um another thing that I love of my spring jewelry is like it's a ring bracelet kind of thing so you put the ring on your middle finger here and then it turns into a bracelet so obviously you don't wear it over your clothes you wear it on your hand but um it'll go like that and it ties in, or not ties, the clasps over here, and um, the, the like imprint on it is just like this little stone, and it's white and brown, and I just love it so, so much, and I'm so happy I can bring it back. And then my favorite pair of earrings are these earrings I ordered off of Etsy, and they're literally just like... I don't even know the color. They're just very light bluish, greenish color, and they have a brown outlining, and they're 
they're pretty big. I mean, the earrings I have on now, they're fairly big studs. I think they were handmade, and they're just beautiful, and I think they'll go with a lot of things for spring since they are such a springy color, and I'm so excited to wear them. Question number six is, what spring trends are you most excited about this year? And it can be makeup or fashion. Um, so I think for fashion, I'm really excited about that very like sleek, clean look, very Madewell J. Crew, like clean cut. And I feel like this happens every spring. Even people dress like that for like fall and winter. But I feel like fall and winter you can be more grungy and summer is more like hipster and everything. And you can of course do these in all the months, but for me, I feel as if like spring is very like elegant and classy and I just picture like these beautiful prints and colors and everything is just so um, like ironed and clean and I'm excited for all those floral prints to come. And then for makeup, I'm really excited to see other people wearing bold lips. I know that sounds kind of weird, but like I just can't really wear bold lips out. I don't feel like they're that suitable for me and if they are, I can't really wear them because I don't really have places to wear bold lips to. But um, I love when I see YouTubers wearing bold lips, so I'm really excited for that. And then I'm very excited for just the overall, ov ah, overall, overall coral look, like coral cheek, like bright cheeks. I love that. For example, I have like this Tarte blush, and it's just so pigmented, and I've been w excited to wear it for spring, and it's in the color Flush, and it's just like such a pretty bright bright color and so suitable for spring or summer and I'm just really excited for all the coral looks and like spring colors and golds and blues and oranges and not that I can necessarily pull those off but um, I just think they're such beautiful looks. Number seven is what is your favorite spring candle? I have two favorite spring candles and um, so one of them is of course from Bath and Body Works and it is white sand and it's just a white candle it smells like like I said when I think about spring I think about clean and it just smells so refreshing and clean like I'm at the beach literally white sand it does not smell like sand my all-time favorite candle is this one and it is from Anthropology I got it from Anthropology and um, it is the I'm not going to be able to pronounce this. Voluspa Goji Taraco Orange. I have no idea, but um, that's it's like a tin packaging. It's red. Comes like this. It's a white candle actually, but um, that's I love the packaging on it, and it just smells so fruity and so amazing. I can't even tell you. I love lighting this candle. Question number eight is what is your favorite body spray or perfume for spring? My favorite perfume for spring I would have to say is this Love Sweet Love Philosophy perfume and I think I got it in a sample box but um, yeah that's the sample size and I've used it a little I mean I barely used it but um, it's just so it smells it just smells so like again I just love those clean smells for spring and it's just I love the smell it smells like love I feel like spring for me I like group it together with love and so I guess this is a very fitting perfume for me I think I don't know love is in the air spring blah 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 but um, it smells really nice and if you haven't checked it out I really suggest you check this perfume out because it's one of my all-time favorite perfumes Number nine is, what is spring like where you live? So where I live, spring has not really started yet. About two weeks ago, actually, the weekend was v very warm. There is, it was about 70 something degrees here, and I wore shorts and t-shirts outside, and it just felt so nice. But then the week after that, in like this past week, it's been in the 40s, 50s, and 60s. So the weather is obviously very bipolar, but um, usually, it gets, it's supposed to be hot around now, but I guess it's going to get hot probably next week and hopefully it'll stay a little warmer. But um, spring is usually like coldest in the high 60s probably and um, mid 70s, which that's my favorite weather of all time. It's perfect, it's pleasant, I can wear shorts and a t-shirt and not be too hot, too cold. Um, I can just go on walks. 
and from with my dog and I just I love that weather number 10 is what is your favorite thing about spring so I kind of touched on this a little bit earlier well one I love the weather obviously um but my favorite thing is probably just that feeling that I associate with spring I associate like love and happiness I just love spring so much okay I sound really weird but like I promise I'm not that weird but I just I love spring I can't help it okay it's like top up there and my top favorite seasons actually I say that about every season I don't know what I'm talking about doesn't every beauty guru <sighs> number 11 is are you a spring cleaner no I hate cleaning number 12 and which is the last and final question do you have any plans for spring break and or an upcoming vacation and if so like what are they I guess that was implied in the question um well actually in two days from now, I have spring break. Well, that starts tomorrow after school because tomorrow will be Friday. Um, and I'm filming this on a Thursday. But um, so Saturday morning, I'm going down to the beach with a lot of my friends. And um, I'm going to be there for about the whole week. And I just can't wait for that beach weather and for going in my bathing suits. And... Um, so I'll finally get that final sense of spring when I go. Alright guys, thank you for sticking with me through this video. If you are still watching, thank you so much for watching. And um, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks, bye!